Patrick here again with you. Just a quick uh, recap of what I got going on on my project bench before I take you down to the layout. I will flip the camera around, I'll review the layout with you, tell you what I've done and what we still got to do and then I will flip the camera around show you a couple projects I've got in work and then we'll head downstairs. So again, so again this is my layout. Uh, my outer green track is done and laid down, a couple spots I have to glue. Um, but I've got trains running on it. My inner yellow track is done. A couple spots I do have to uh, glue down, but I've got trains running on it. Uh, this track is being glued as we speak, um, and then I'll be able to run on it. I still got to install, you know, track bumper for those. I've got to install the actual uh, turnout switches to, to make the turnouts move. And right now they're just uh, pinned into position, and I still have to do my yard and my two spurs. Um, that's on tomorrow's agenda When I was gluing down these I actually glued this switch backwards So it was facing the opposite direction, which is what I did not want So I actually had to take it out and it ended up moving down this way a little um, But it's already back together. I just have to glue it down the trains are already running on it. I have some more um, Really thin wood I'm gonna be building a bridge for that Nothing fancy, just the same type of bridge that the Metro North runs over under most of the overpasses around here. And beyond that, that's where my layout is. Nothing else has really changed. Um, but that's about it for that. So if you hold on a second, I'll show you the projects I'm working on. So this was a uh, air track, track cleaning car I picked up on eBay. I actually picked up two of them. The other one I have sitting in a box for spare parts. Repainted it in my home orange. I attempted to two decals. It didn't turn out so well, but I'll get better at that. Put everything else back in. Um, just waiting on some new uh, traction, traction, whatever you want to call them, the traction things for the uh, wheels. Other than that, the engine's already been uh, broken down to parade rest and overhauled, so that's good to go. It'll be ready to clean the track on the layout real soon. This is the um, chassis and motor for my passenger train that I'm painting which is all silver along with the consist it's all gonna be silver with a New Haven orange stripe down the side it'll get decals eventually um, completely overhauled the motor took away those stupid bars uh, replaced it with wire cleaned up the chassis underneath and it actually connects different which is why the bottom brass bar is actually up here um, I have a couple of spare motors. I'm actually going to rewind the motors. Uh, a little bit of better wire, a bit of better materials. Um, speed it up a little. Right now this one's not very fast, but it actually has a lot of torque. The more windings you put inside, um, the more torque you're going to be carrying, but the less speed you're going to have. So I'm actually going to do a little experimenting there. This is a track maintenance car. I'm just repainting it. Did have a little Santa Fe logo right here I didn't like. Not doing anything fancy to it. Just going to put some better wheels on it after I finish painting it. Um, maybe stick a couple other random things down here with it. That'll be one of my uh, maintenance away repair, track repair uh, cars for my maintenance away train that I'm working on. This is the first of one of the passenger cars I'm repainting. Stripped them all down. I have six cars total. Pulled all the windows out. Repainted them with the metallic silver spray paint. Same paint that's on the locomotive. I really like how shiny they are. Putting down the orange, and it is New Haven orange because I'm not that original and I kind of like it. And the whole run will look like this, and at some point I'll put decals and stuff on them. Not entirely sure what I want to do with that, so I don't want to put anything there yet. It's just going to run decal list for a while. I have a lot of cabooses, and seem to have a lot of Union Pacific cabooses. So I'm going to end up kit bashing these two together somehow. Not quite sure yet. Um, but it's going to end up on my maintenance away train. Which means it's either going to be orange or it's going to be black. I haven't decided yet. Um, I'm going to basically probably end up cutting the two of them in half. Making it a little longer. Making it look fancy. Not quite sure what I'm going to do yet. I just know I'm cutting them in half. I'm going to see what I want to do with it. This guy I actually got out of my parts box. Um, it was broken pretty bad. Um, doors are gone. Were broken off the rails broken off so put it back together found magic set of wheels put on it i'm gonna put metal wheels on it eventually 
Um, put some more stuff inside it. Not really sure what the load in there is supposed to be. But I'll make it look like something. Painted the ladders black. Put a little bit of random blacks on the roof. Nothing fancy. But for my first attempt at doing anything really to a boxcar, I don't think it looks that bad. Hey, back down here at the layout again. Just giving you an update of progress we've made. Give me a second to flip the camera around and I'll show you. And yeah, that's running trains you here in the background. So, here's the layout as it stands right now. Both my inner and outer loops are running. Uh, one spur is done. I still have to do the yard. Uh, that'll probably be tomorrow or the next day. I gotta clear all our extra work stuff off. That switch over there was originally back there. I put it in backwards, so I had to flip it around, change the uh, turnouts. We got that fixed. That's nice and easy. Uh, I actually got my little control panel over here. I've got power connected to the track here, 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 and roughly right there on all the tracks. The yard tracks will have their own power, and this spur will eventually get its own power. That's our, our lake, slash pond, slash river. I'm building the bridge right there. for right there. Uh, next time you see this layout, we should have a lot of the mess cleaned up and some of our existing buildings down here. That's about what we have for now.